Breaking news, $2,000 could be hitting your bank account this Friday. Yes, you heard that right. The IRS just dropped a bombshell announcement that's going to change everything for millions of Americans. If you're on Social Security, SSISSDI, or receiving via benefits, you'll want to hear this. We're talking about a brand new stimulus check, and it's coming faster than you think. Stick around, because in the next few minutes, I'm going to break down exactly who's eligible, when you'll get paid, and what you need to do right now to make sure you don't miss out on this cash. Trust me, this is news you can't afford to ignore. Welcome to Wealth Boss, your trusted source for the latest updates on Social Security and for the stimulus checks tailored for American seniors, including SSSDI and VIA recipients. I hope you are all doing well. Let's get right into it. The IRS has just made a shocking announcement that's going to affect millions of Americans. That's right, we're talking about a brand new round of stimulus checks, and this time, it's targeting some of our most vulnerable citizens. So, if you're receiving Social Security, SSI, SSDI, or VIA benefits, you'll want to stick around because this news could mean an extra $2,000 in your pocket as soon as this Friday. Let's dive into the details. All right, let's start with the basics. Just hours ago, the Internal Revenue Service dropped a bombshell announcement. They're releasing a new round of stimulus checks, specifically aimed at beneficiaries of Social Security, Supplemental Security Income, SSI, Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, and Veterans Affairs via programs. These $2,000 checks are set to start hitting bank accounts this Friday, which is just X days from now. This is huge news, folks, and it's coming at a time when many Americans are still struggling to recover from the economic impacts of the past few years. Veterans Affairs, via benefits. If you're in any of these categories, you're likely eligible for the full $2,000 payment. But here's the kicker, unlike previous stimulus checks, there doesn't appear to be an income cap on this one. That means even if you have other sources of income, as long as you're receiving one of these benefits, you should be in line for the full amount. You might be asking yourself, why now? Why these specific groups? Well, according to statements from both the IRS and the White House, this decision comes as a response to ongoing economic challenges faced by many Americans, particularly those on fixed incomes. With inflation still a concern and the cost of living continuing to rise, many seniors and disabled individuals have been hit especially hard. This stimulus check is aimed at providing some much-needed relief to these vulnerable populations. It's worth noting that this move has received bipartisan support in Congress, which is pretty rare these days. Now, let's talk about the all-important question, how and when will you get your money? The IRS has stated that the distribution of these checks will begin this Friday. If you've received previous stimulus payments via direct deposit, you're in luck you'll be among the first to receive this new payment. The IRS will use the same bank information they have on file from your benefit payment. If you typically receive your benefits via paper check or EIP card, don't worry your payment will be sent out in the same manner, but it might take a few extra days to reach you. The IRS estimates that over 90% of eligible recipients should receive their payments within two weeks. But what if Friday comes and goes, and you haven't seen that $2,000 hit your account? Don't panic just yet. The IRS has set up a dedicated hotline for inquiries about these payments. We'll put the number on the screen now, and you'll also find it in the description below. They've also updated the Get My Payment tool on their website which you can use to track the status of your stimulus check. Remember, while the rollout begins on Friday, it may take a few days for all payments to be processed and distributed. Let's zoom out for a moment and consider the bigger picture. This injection of cash into the economy isn't just about helping individuals. It's also expected to have a significant impact on the economy as a whole. Economic experts are predicting that this $2,000 stimulus could lead to a noticeable boost in consumer spending. This is especially true given that the recipients are likely to spend a large portion of this money quickly on necessities like food, medication, and utilities. Some economists are projecting that this could lead to a 0.3% to 0.5% increase in GDP growth for the quarter. Now, 
it's important to note that not everyone is thrilled about this news. Some critics argue that this targeted stimulus could lead to increased inflation, potentially negating the benefits for the very people it's meant to help. Others question the long-term sustainability of such payments and worry about the impact on the national debt. These are valid concerns, and it'll be interesting to see how policymakers address them in the coming weeks and months. Now, I know what many of you are thinking, is this a one-time thing, or could there be more payments coming? Well, the official line from the IRS and the White House is that this is currently a one-time payment. However, several members of Congress have already begun pushing for this to become a recurring payment for these benefit recipients. While it's far too early to say whether that will happen, it's certainly something to keep an eye on. As always, we'll keep you updated on any developments. Before we wrap up, I want to touch on a really important point scams. Unfortunately, whenever there's news about government payments, scammers come out of the woodwork. Remember, the IRS will never call, text, or email you asking for personal information related to this stimulus payment. They already have all the information they need. If someone contacts you claiming to be from the IRS and asks for your social security number, bank details, or any other sensitive information, it's a scam. Hang up, delete the email, and report it to the proper authorities. Stay vigilant, folks. This is a developing story, and we'll be sure to keep you updated on any new information as it becomes available. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and consider subscribing to the channel for more updates on financial news and tips. And hey, if you know someone who might be eligible for this payment, share this video with them you might just be helping them get $2,000 richer. Before you go, I want to hear from you. What do you think about this new stimulus payment? Do you think it's enough, or should the government be doing more? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to stay up to date on all the latest financial news and tips, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. Thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.